Oh. I got showered in glass. Or. Okay, that was way easier. I give up. <laughs> Um, what about this one? Yeah, I don't think she'll do. Dude, I can build a wonderful Fortnite fort out of this. So, if you've ever seen a riot and you've seen someone throw a brick at a window, you'll notice that it bounces off. And this is because a brick just isn't that strong. On substances, you're looking at something called an MOHS or a MO scale. Imagine diamonds being a 9, 9.5. Tempered glass is about six, 6.5, and a baseball bat or something of that nature is, it's about four. So you're not really going to be able to do this. So when you're looking at getting rid of it, you have to use a specialty tool. That was so amazing. Oh my God, this crumbles like rice. I cannot believe it. Dude, so, can I get the other one? I'm so happy right now. Oh wait, I have it already. You have it. So once again, I can try it with a baseball bat. Nada. All right, this one doesn't have the spring power. And then, done. Oh my god, that's so fun. I can't believe it. So this is the Swiss Tech Bodyguard, and it's got the same breaker as this stat gear knife, but it's just basically built into this little keychain. Oh! Whoa! That exploded! This is another stat gear product. It's got a seatbelt cutter and they added the little uh, breaker on there. Just watch how easy this is. This is the Fortnite shovel multi-tool. Now I believe uh, front windshields are a little bit different. As you can see, that's protecting you, but we got this tip. I don't know if it's gonna work. So it's the same type of windshield thing. It's not, that has plexiglass on it. So that's plexiglass. Let's try the actual glass breaker portion. Yeah, that's it, man. Just shows you can't build a fort with a shovel. It's a pocket knife, it's everything, and can get you out of trouble. So disappointed this didn't work. I was like thinking, like how does it go through the windshield like that? Please do not hit me when you do this. Okay. How about you hit it with the baseball bat twice, All toss right. that behind you, grab the shovel, hit it twice, and then I just do that once. All right, that good. This I'll do it. I got showered in glass. Or. Okay, that was way easier. I give up. <laughs> well, that's good. This is another product by Stat Gear. It's uh, like an office pen. It's got a knife in it and one of those little breakers, they kind of snuck that in. Smashing a window, it's pretty easy. The seat belt's a little bit harder, but once you get a hold of it. Yeah, that's great. <laughs> I can't do it. Can't do it. it has to be attached to hmm? Here. Use uh -uh. This one over no, here. I can do that this way. Don't be dumb, man. Just use this. So, cutting a seat belt. Oh, it's 
it's pretty difficult. I mean, this thing is meant to save your life. This is another one by Swiss Tech. I don't know how you would do this. Maybe not the easiest to use in a time of emergency. I almost want to push down on this, but that's gonna actually smash my finger with the little breaker So, tip. and how easy is the other one? Uh, just compare. So, just so that we're fair. Like that. Yeah. Pretty simple. Cool. So if you remember this, it's from the uh, other video. It's basically the hidden sleeve arrow. But this one doesn't actually shoot out because we want it to be safer. First, I'm gonna try and stab it. Oh, you're right. <laughs> and you can see it actually bent. So Obviously, we started off with a baseball bat and a utilitarian shovel, and this can't really... Oh, oh my, my god. The tip's actually flat. Oh my... This is not gonna get you out of your car. You really need a specialty tool, but Stat Gear makes such good utility knives. Yeah. And I would put one of these in my car if I had to pick any of them that we looked at today. I mean, it's simply... Bam! And it's over. So... This is something we'd highly recommend. We would like to thank Stat Gear for sending it. We're gonna put an Amazon affiliate link below if you wanna buy this. It could save your life if you find yourself in a situation like this, and it has been tested. Depends what you're looking for. Probably the T3 Tactical. This one has it all. It's got the best glass breaker. It's pretty much idiot proof. You just basically pop it in the window. This is the one that Fu used to put me to shame whenever I was kind of all proud about the fail Fortnite tactical shovel. But this one's nice because it has the uh, fold out knife and also probably the runner up on the seatbelt cutter next to the Supervisor XT. So I'd recommend this one. It also has this little carrying case if that's how you want to rock it. So here is the fail Fortnite shovel glass breaker tip. You can see how flat that thing got. It really did not do anything to damage the windows and I was hitting it pretty hard. I also kind of shoveled glass into my face, so maybe pass on that one. But I really wanna find out if there's some better options out there for tactical shovels because I think these are really neat. So let me know what you think in the comment below. I've seen some other ones that can be used as like grappling hooks. I don't know if I believe it. So the Swiss Tech Bodyguard is pretty cool. I think it has a comparable breaker tip here, but the seatbelt cutter is absolute garbage. It's kind of just a razor blade. You can't get a very good grip on this thing to actually use it. And I feel like if I did put a grip on it, I would actually puncture myself with the glass breaker portion. So I would pass on this one if I were you. Here we have the Blitz Blade 2.0. This glass breaker is really nice. It's very straightforward, very easy to understand. You could hand this to someone and they'd automatically know. This one kind of reminds me of a Doctor Who sonic screwdriver. There's so many gadgets in here. It's all kind of unscrews. And if you wanna check that out, there's a affiliate link in the description. This one's really cool. So this is the Stat Gear Supervisor. It's got a little carrying case that goes on your car's visor, hence the name Supervisor. And I think this is probably the best for your seatbelt cutter. It has the exposed blade. It's got a really wide mouth, so you don't have to worry about fidgeting with it. It's gonna grab on easily. A nice handle. The only thing that I didn't like about it, and this probably was user error on my part, but I'm going in at this angle and you can see the way that the tip is facing. So what you really wanna do is hold it this way. That way you're going in uh, in a similar fashion. So I think that's how you're supposed to use this, although maybe I didn't read the directions on the box. It does say that it was designed by a paramedic, so I trust their judgment more than probably mine because I'm just the gadget guru. So this is the TriTac Everyday Carry Pen. It's got the glass breaker here on the end and also this knife. You can see I was trying to use it and I kept hitting it on the side here. Well, that doesn't really help me. So by adding this knife, I think it's really cool to have that extra feature made a little bit more difficult than I would have liked, but I still think it's a pretty solid product. So this was a really awesome opportunity to test out some of this gear. Hopefully 
you don't have to come to this point where you're using it in an emergency situation, but Stat Gear definitely has your back. A lot of their tools are really awesome, and I think that there's some that are better than others. So thank you so much for watching. I had a lot of fun today. Thank you so much to Spitz Auto Parts. Feel free to check out some of our other everyday carry gadget videos, and also leave a comment below letting us know maybe there's another product out there that you want us to try, or maybe we can try and engineer one ourselves. Who knows?